Are we ready for more comedy, guys? Come on! Yeah! What a crowd. Yeah. All right. You're going to love this next guy. Very, very funny guy. He plays all around the country and all around town, too. And uh, he's a funny man. Give him a big hand. Mr. Matt Hummel. Come on, guys. How's it going, guys? Keep it going for Frazier. All right. Yeah. Oh, man. What a night. What a night. I was, I was invited to go bowling tonight instead of this. I was invited to go bowling. Any bowlers? Yeah. <laughs> Screw bowling. Ugh. I don't like bowling, though. I'll be honest. I don't like bowling. I just feel weird sticking three fingers into something that doesn't slap me in the face. <laughs> That's a force of habit. It's not, bowling's not a sport. My favorite sport is drinking. Right? Yeah. There we go. Remember when you used to go to high school drunk and you were a riot? And now you go to high school drunk and you're a bad parent? <laughs> ch, ch changes I, I saw all my friends from high school about a month ago. I, I went back home and everyone got a lot bigger. You know, every, it's like I put my fat glasses on. I'm like, there you are. But uh, they would come up to me and they're like, Matt, you look great. And I wanted to extend the same compliment. So I'm like, hey, you sure look comfortable. I bet I could take a nap on you. Uh, you sure like bacon. <laughs> but everyone's having babies. I think that's why, which is fine. I like, I like babies. I can't have one though, because I think I'd have a baby for like two weeks before I see how much weed I could get for it. You know? Come on, buddy, let's go pound for pound. Yeah, it's 20 pounds, six ounces. <laughs> it was good to see some friends, but I just, I just don't like flying. Uh, part of it is because, like, you know, the World Trade Center movie just came out. Right? Don't you think it's a little too soon? I just saw a bad Nicolas Cage movie. <laughs> All right? Give me another five years after Weatherman, then we can talk. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm afraid of death. I don't want to die and go to heaven. All right, because uh, what if Muslims are right and there are 72 virgins up there waiting for me, all right? I've had sex with a virgin before and a lot of work goes into that process. Like, <laughs> yeah, I've been there. Like if I, Matt Hummel, I'm going to have a chance with these 72 virgins. I'm gonna need 144 wine coolers in a John Mayer CD. And then we'd have to have the sex talk. I tell her now it, it might hurt a little. And then there'd be crying. Matt, you're getting tears on my sweater. I'm like, oh, I'm sorry but I really love this song. Cause my body really is a wonderland. It really is. <laughs> my, girl, my girlfriend's crazy. She thinks she's real. Yeah, that's right ladies, I'm available. Line up. Girls out here like tough guys, you know, badasses. Guys, guys that ride motorcycles. And you know, look at me, I can't afford a motorcycle. So I just drive my car with one headlight out. <laughs> yeah. Pop that bitch on the sidewalk. I'm a badass woman, I'm a tough guy. Woman, woman. She fell off the back of my Escort. Shoulda, shoulda held on, shoulda held on. Uh, a lot of people say I'm crazy. Um, one for one, my, my college writing professor goes, Matt, I think you're a psychopath. I'm like, hey, name calling's not gonna get you out of my basement. <laughs> so put the lotion in the basket. 
rub the lotion on the skin. Oh, man. I ended up at dive, oh, I was at a dive bar last night. Uh, yeah, yeah, big fan of dive bars. I am, but I had this uh, a weird situation. I had, I, I was doing the last call shuffle, and I go up to this girl, and I was like, hey, my name is Matt, Let, let's get out of here. She looks at me, and she's like, Phew. in your dreams. I'm like, ouch. I thought about it, I'm like, hey, in my dreams, I wouldn't be at some dive bar. I'd be in my house made of butterscotch, right next to the river of wishes, huh? And you would all be there ladling the wishes. And in my dreams, my car wouldn't run on gasoline. My car would run on children's laughter. Yeah. And I'd be doing way hotter women than you. Right? Now you ladies here, because you'd all be there in my dreams, and you'd have like six, no, eight breasts. And not all in the same place either. It'd be like every time we hug a booby scavenger hunt. Like, what? Where are they? Marco? Paula? Down the small of your back, you're in my little booby stegosaurus. Aww. I love dinosaurs. What can I say? I say, there was a, on Saturday note, there, there was a huge car accident outside my house uh, a couple of days ago. It was, a, it was a four car pile up after one car had swerved to miss a running dog. And my roommate runs out and goes, Matt, you need to do something. You should call 911. You know, but I thought I'd done enough by throwing the Frisbee. <laughs> it's like, I'm gonna wash my hands of this. All right, man. I'm gonna go inside and play Xbox. I want to end. I want to end on a poem. Do you guys like poems? Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Got you a little snapping to set a poetry ambiance. Jive, man. Jive. All right. Simmer. <laughs> Baby. It's about my favorite part of a girl's body. It's her belly. Yeah. Baby, I love your shapely belly. The way it dribbles over your shorts and escapes the comfort of your t-shirt. Because I don't want a midriff, no, I want a landing strip. Something for my digits to explore, caress, and adore. Because if I were a bellhop, then I'd want your excess baggage. Let me help you out with those. Let me grip those hot and heavy handles and escort you up to your room. Because you're like an inverted wine bottle and I get drunk off your curves. I drink and drown in that vast oasis, wake up, and I'm captive inside your navel. And when my head hurts, when it writes with pain, I lay it on that supple hot water bottle, warm and soft like scrambled eggs. Sugar, I love your shapely belly. But the baby inside has to go. <laughs> Thank you, Matt Hummel. This is one of my favorite jokes. It's gonna blow your panties off. I, uh... These two muffins are in an oven. One muffin says to the other muffin, it's hot in here. The other muffin says, holy crap, a talking muffin! <laughs> talking muffins are scary people. Have a good night, I'm Matt Hummel. A big hand for Matt, guys. Give him a big hand. He was great.